it's time for your 2024 Milwaukee Brewers. Please welcome the manager of the Milwaukee Brewers in his first season, number 21, Pat Murphy. Batting ninth and playing right field, number 11, Jackson Curio. Starting pitcher for the Brewers today, Jacob Junis. He makes his Brewers debut, was pitching mostly out of the bullpen last year with San Francisco, gets the call in game number four. As Julian hits a soft ground ball to second base. One up, one down. Just what Junis wants to see, a lot of soft contact. Brings up Alex Kirloff. He's doing the DHing. Ground ball towards the middle. Adamas into a slide, gets up, throws to first, the scoop and got him. Already Willie Adamas. What a play. That's one of the things that the Brewers did so well against the Mets. Playing defense, did not commit an error in New York. And what a start for Willie here today. Two up, two are down. This is Byron Buxton. To center field, Freelick got a good jump on it, makes the catch. It's a one, two, three first on just eight pitches for Jacob Junis. It'll be Louis Varlet made 10 starts last year, but those seven appearances out of the bullpen are really what opened a lot of eyes. Down the stretch and in the postseason, touching 100 miles an hour with that fastball, added that cutter, went down, started throwing that sinker. Look at that, painted 98. Now the outside corner, great sequence. Three pitches, Sal Freelig is out number one. Strikeout and a walk for Varlin. And now the veteran Yelich, who got a roar from this crowd when he was introduced up the first baseline. Runner stays. Back to Varlin. He'll look to second, take the out, and Yelich. Two down, so Yelich weak contact, but does move. Contreras down to second. Well, the Adamas will be the batter. Adamas up the middle. But Julian right there. An extra throw and a hop and Adamas grounds out and Varlin puts up a zero to begin his season. Max Kepler great to see him back. And he smacks a base hit to left. That's a good sign right there. That was something he adjusted as the year went along last year. We saw him using the middle of the field a little bit more. And the pitch swing and a miss struck him out. Got up and in on Correa. One away from Matt Walner. Swing and a miss back to back K's. Here is Carlos Santana. Struck him out swinging. He strikes out the side after the leadoff base hit. Reese Hoskins swinging a bouncer hit to third. That is going to be a base hit. Castro made the play, but he had no chance to stop right himself and then get off a throw. No chance. The bases are loaded for Churio. See what kind of ovation Churio gets from his hometown crowd the first time he comes to the plate. There's Churio going to sit to right. One runs in. One nothing Milwaukee. Another RBI for Churio. How about that swing, huh? For a 20 year old opening day packed house, he doesn't care. Terrain goes to third, Churio to second, Freelich the fielder's choice at first, and William Contreras, the silver slugging catcher, will be the hitter. Good pitch. Strike three called. Crowd doesn't like it, but that was a good pitch. Edward Julian, leadoff man, is coming to the plate. Got him looking. One, two, three, go the Twins. Christian Yelich leads off the bottom of the third. A of his home runs last year came uh, you know, to the left field side of center field. 3-2, this is driven out to center. Back goes Buxton at the track at the wall. Gone! Christian Yelich, his second blast of the season. A great series in New York over the weekend. And it carries over to the start of the homestand. The Brewers lead it two to zero. Done at first, Hoskins at second. And the Brewers with a two out threat here with Bryce Terang coming to the plate. Terang shoots one down the left field line. That's a fair ball. Hoskins scores. It's an RBI double for Bryce Terang. How about that on a one two pitch. He just talked about Terang and his confidence with two strikes. Easy double with the speed for Terang. Churio cashing again. Churio to the left side. Castro throws him out in the inning ends. Buxton lined out to center. To right. Shallow. Yep. Fading. Fading. Down a base hit. Kirloff will make second hold there. So the Twins have two men on for the first time all day. Soft single to right from Buxton. And he'll have to work around a little bit of traffic here in the top of the fourth. Kepler down the right field line. Churio makes the catch right at his knees. 
Throw goes into second as Kirloff ended up going to third base, and Rocco Baldelli may hold things up for just a moment. See if he caught it or trapped it. Clearly a catch out there. Base is loaded for the Twins. Down 3-0. The batter's going to be Matt Walner. Walner was part of that 2-2 two -two pitch. A swing and a fly ball to right. Churio to make the catch. Kirloff tags heading home. The throw to third is way offline. Missed the cutoff man. So Buxton not only makes third as Kirloff scores, but Correa is able to move up to second, and it's a 3-1 game. Santana the hitter. Ground ball second base. Terang has it on two hops. And Junis holds the Twins to just one. Catcher Contreras walking a strikeout. Line to third. Castro there. Christian Yelich will bat two down. Struck him out. Went with a cutter off the outside corner. And Louis Varlin for the first time today has a one, two, three inning. Twins are down two as they start the fifth. And Jacob Junis is done as Milwaukee makes a pitching change. Yeah, it'll be Elvis Peguero, power arm, big six five righty. Got him on the back door with the slider. It's been there for much of the afternoon. Contreras presents it to the home plate umpire, making that one look better. Miguero trying to go clean through this fifth inning. Julian towards left. Will it stay in play for Yelich nearing the line? He's there. He makes the catch. Just enough space. Alex Kirloff leads it off. And the pitch swing and a miss on a beautiful changeup and a strikeout. Byron Buxton is the batter now. Buxton a swing and a miss. There's that super sinker from Elvis. Tied him up inside. Kepler one out of two. To the shortstop. Adamas to a knee to get it. Throws out Kepler. One, two, three for Piguero. First and second now. They've been gifted a glorious opportunity here in the top of the seventh. And here's Carlos Santana. Ground ball to short. Adamas. Bobbles. Got to play it first. Scoop by Bowers in time. Oh, what, what a nice, play. What a pick. Boy, that could have been a disaster. That ball gets by Bowers. A run's going to be in. And Margot's probably at third base. What a chance here for the Twins. It's Vasquez the batter. Now it was Christian Vasquez who delivered with the bases loaded in Kansas City. 0 for 2 in this game. He's popped up and he's flied out to left. A swing and a fly ball to the gap in left center field. Yelich is there. He'll make the catch. Correa will tag and he will score. And this is a one run game. Going to get a pinch hitter for the leadoff man, Julian. Kyle Farmer is going to come off the bench. Got him looking. Got the fastball on the inside corner. Alex Kirilov, a 3 2 Brewers lead. The Twins with just three hits this afternoon. Ground ball, right side. Bowers with a tricky hop, has it, gets it to Pyops for the first out. Boy, what a glove he's featuring so far this year. Boy, that was a tough play. That ball ate him up, but able to keep it in the glove. So one away for Byron Buxton. You likely know the story on Buxton by now. Win healthy, one of the most exciting players in baseball. Liner caught by Dunn. Put a cape on him. Yeah. Well, sometimes guys even surprise themselves with that catch. Check it out. A couple of steps, a dive, and able to keep it in the glove. Well done. Byron right there. That face says it all. Oliver Dunn. Right side, Santana with a great pick. To his feet and to the bag. Some great defense on all sides today. Carlos Santana was a Gold Glove finalist last year, and a play like that is a big reason why. And with two away now, Carlos Santana is the batter. Rebay trying to get him and save his third. Swing and a bouncer. Softly hit second base. Terang gloves. Ball game. A home opening win for Milwaukee and another save for Uribe.